I'm going to give tools today. Let's unbox and install these seat covers that I got from Custom Interior. In this video, I want to show you the proper way to install these so that they stay in place and so that they're, they fit very well and very snug. So let's just get to it. Beep, 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 beep. Bam. Custom Interior. My seats are pretty brand new. They still smell brand new. They look good still, but that looks so good you guys it really does custom interior did a great job designing these it really almost is flawless in how these seat covers actually cover the seat i'm very impressed with these i love these i'm so glad the custom interior sent me these not too shabby at all if you ask me it's not a bad alternative at all First thing you gotta do is take them out of the box and just separate the pieces from each other so you know what goes where. It's common sense, you guys. All you gotta do is put it, like sort of match it up. You'll get where it is. It took about two hours to do. If I didn't film this process, it would have been a lot quicker, but it is still only took me two hours to install these seat covers. All you gotta do is look at the design of your car, look at the design of the seat covers, take a look at the bungee cord hooks, and it's pretty much common sense from there. Everything fits in its place. It is easier to put the seat part on than the back on second. As you can see, a very easy, very quick and easy install. And I'm amazed at how well these shape around the around the seat. <laughs> Little Velcro on the back. Gotta put those holes in there, then they're not nice and snug. And now don't be afraid to tug and pull on this. Like this is very strong material. I was tugging and pulling on these bungee hooks like crazy and nothing broke. On my back seat, all I had to do is flip this little switch and then I was able to pull the seat forward. I did have to use a razor to cut a little slit in the fabrics just so I could attach those hooks to the support for the seat. And they're in there nice and snug. Just stuff it in there, and you do the same process for every seat, but these seat covers really do cover this perfectly. Same thing with the headdress, you just sort of wiggle it into place, and of course after you are done installing it, make sure you clean your car. Optional, of course. Seats still go up, no problem, and they stay up, that it's not too bulky, and it fits just fine. It's seriously a nice fit, you guys. These are worth... I should have bought these a long time ago. Perfect fit. I love these seats. They look so good. They really do. Still have access to the little strap to pull, so you can put your seat back down. the part that drove me the craziest but i figured it out pretty quick to get these to stay all you got to do is wrap them around the straps simple as that as soon as i figure that out done you do that to every you do that to as many as you can and you try to do that to all of them for every seat then they're not going to come out by themselves and look at the final product these are seriously so awesome i'm so glad i got these i use these for the past couple days and i am not taking them out till summertime Even got some night shots for you so you can see what it looks like with the light. And what a difference, you guys. What a difference. I love the way that these look. It feels so great, too. Everything's operational. And it's good to go. Look at that. Two of these pieces are for the model of the truck to where you actually don't have a middle console, you have a center seat instead. So this comes with that seat cover. As you can see, it has the cup holders there and it has the headrest, but I don't have that, so I do not need this. And it, But it comes in the kit just in case if you do. I am not sure what this one is for. I do not, I'm not gonna lie. I have no clue what this one is for. Uh, never saw this, I don't, I don't have this in my truck, so. I don't have it, but one thing I did not want to use is the middle console uh, for my armrest. The seats are very good. This is going to be well worth the purchase, you guys. Like I was eyeballing these for a long time, 
and I'm actually lucky that this company contacted me to install these, test them out, and do a video on them because I wanted these a while ago. I never just pulled the trigger on buying it because it was just something that uh, I would look at and then I'd forget about it. But I didn't get leather seats for the car for a reason. I'm a water guy. I go into the vehicle wet all the time with a wet swimsuit or a wet shirt. And in the past, with all my leather seats in previous cars, I destroyed the leather and it would just, just wouldn't look good anymore. It wouldn't sit good, you know, like the leather just deteriorated. But during summer, I am going to take the two front seat covers out because I just don't want to worry about this deteriorating if I keep going on to the seat cover wet. I it probably eventually will, it'll just like leather does. I should have bought this right from the beginning because I would have had this last fall, winter, and spring. And so, and I'm excited to use these during. Uh, fall, winter, and spring. So that's pretty much it, you guys. Hope you found this video helpful and entertaining. Please like this video. Please hit the bell button to be notified of future videos. And please subscribe to the channel. This is Dave Nicholas. Thank you for tuning in. I'll see you guys next time.